This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2019 AACA Fall Meet in Hershey, Pennsylvania. We are checking out uh, 19A Early 30s Luxury. This is, of course, the 31 Franklin. These are the air-cooled cars. Very uh, luxurious, very nicely done from Syracuse, uh, New York. Just beautiful cars, assemble nicely. The neat little thing with uh, Franklin is that they kept going with air cool. And in fact, they started making helicopter motors as air cooled motors, uh, again, still in Syracuse. They got bought out by a company by the name of Tucker. And Tucker originally was going to go into, use their uh, six cylinder air cool in the, his cars, but he converted it to water cool. This is a Lincoln, 1930 Lincoln. I gotta get the model. Bear with me a minute. Eight cylinder, what is it? I don't know. I don't know, let me check it out. <coughs> Let's see. Uh, Lincoln L. Okay, so it's an L. It's a V8. Now it's the cigar holder with the lighter. And it's got a roll-up window. Although it's not a limousine, folks. This is not a limousine. Excuse me, what would you describe, what's the model of the uh, Lincoln? It's a model L, but with the roll-up window. It's a Dietrich-built convertible sedan. The, okay, very good. 1930. 1930, excellent. And Dietrich built a convertible Dietrich, sedan. He didn't design it, he designed it and built it. Yes. A lot of them are just Dietrich designed. This is Dietrich built. And my friend has a picture of Ray Dietrich sitting in this car. Really? Yes. Oh, nice. That that must be a real treasure treat. It is. Good photograph. Now, how did, how did you find the car? Uh, it has a... This car belonged to Jack Passy in California for 40 years. And then after he passed, his wife sold it to Reggie. Oh, that's great. There we go. Hi, Reggie. Hey. Cool beans. Thanks for bringing it out. This Thanks. is wonderful. What's the most outstanding feature of your Lincoln? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Reggie. We don't have any There we go. I like that. Reggie's the most. I like that. I like that. It's one of two cars left in existence. With the Dietrich body. 20, 25 of them? Oh, so. They made 40 cars and it's one of two left. Two okay, 40. Out. Very good. I know they always, the custom body companies to stay afloat made these short run uh, cars like Brewster and stuff like that. Uh, so it got really interesting during the 30s trying to survive. So that's intriguing. That is intriguing. And, and it's supposed to have sold for $6,800 at the Chicago Auto Show. Wow. It was supposed to have been a uh, display car there for Lincoln. Yeah. And went to Oak Grove, Illinois originally. Oh, okay. That is some piece of change back then. It was a lot of money. Yeah, definitely. Now, the L is the V8, correct? Right, Yep. Very good. Very good. I got it. All right. Cool beans, Reggie. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Thank you. You're a great peanut gallery. Appreciate it. And donut gallery. Yes. And you like the jackets, right? I love the jackets. This, I love these it. These are the Queensman male chorus jackets for 40 years. Uh huh. We switched over to black, and I got them enough for everybody. That's great. You did wonderful. <laughs> right down to the red ties. These ties are original. Yeah, the only thing is his tie squirts. Watch it. <laughs> we know. And how many of the ties go spinning? No, no. No Class act only. Oh, of course. Tuxedo jackets. There we go. Thanks, guys. Enjoy. Excuse me, folks. Can I get by? Thank you. Excuse me. Let's continue on here. Of course, we've got the Rolls Royce, 1929 Springfield Phantom. Springfield, of course, refers to Springfield, Massachusetts, where they were built since 1919. 
they continued into the early 30s where they finally closed up shop. And what's a show without at least one Duesenberg? And surprisingly, so far, this is the only doozy I've seen. Lots of photos being showed. I gotta wait my turn here. There we go. Oh, let me get past here real quick. Beautiful limousine. There we go. Now we got almost a clear shot. Let's chase this guy out of the way. George. George, can we get a quick shot over here? Thank you. What a striking automobile. And of course, getting all the attention from everybody, including George, who couldn't get enough of it. Thank you, George. This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2019 AACA Fall Meet in Hershey, PA. For more cool events like this, make sure you check NortheastWheelsEvents.com, SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, UKWheelsEvents.com. While you're at it, post and share your events. I'll see you at the shows.